Welcome to Alberta Rheumatology's discussion on JAK inhibitors. JAK inhibitors are DMARDs, or disease-modifying anti-rheumatic drugs. They work by blocking the activity of Janus kinase enzymes, leading to disrupted signaling by the body's immune system. By doing this, they calm the immune system down, leading to decreased inflammation. They can take a few weeks to start working, although different patients may respond differently. There are a few JAK inhibitors currently available, including tofacitinib, baricitinib, and upadacitinib. The typical doses are listed here, and they are all taken by mouth. There are many benefits to JAK inhibitors, including decreased swelling, improved pain and stiffness, improved day-to-day -day functioning, and a reduction in irreversible joint damage. Possible side effects include an upset stomach, lower blood counts, raised cholesterol levels, and liver irritation. There's also the risk for serious infections and blood clots. There are a few things to remember when taking JAK inhibitors. You may need to remain on methotrexate to ensure that the inhibitor works as best as it can. You should watch for a fever and skip your scheduled dose until you're feeling better, although it's always best to check with your doctor if you're unsure what to do. It's important to go for regular blood work to monitor for any problems. And you should tell your doctor about any other medical conditions that you have or any changes that arise. JAK inhibitors are an effective treatment for rheumatoid arthritis and other forms of inflammatory arthritis. For more about JAK inhibitors, please read the information provided on our website at albertarheumatology.com. And as always, do not hesitate to talk to your doctor.